come back to the caravan that is. Just arrived, just had a shower. Uh, waiting for, well we're not waiting for Wendy and Darren, we'll go get our own tea tonight. Eh? Uh, what we're doing this weekend, got something planned again, haven't we? But we'll not spoil it at the beginning of the video, we'll just keep watching. Uh, I've had quite a few comments about the step. I'm going to show you another solution with it in this week's vlog. Aren't I? Yeah. Um, I was going to say, and, I, and I'm still going to say it, to be quite honest, but it's uh, backfired this week a little bit. I was looking at the um, our YouTube videos for the last 12 months, and we've only got two videos in 12 months what's gone under 3,000. And this week's gone under 3,000. Last week's not this week. Uh, last week's he's gone to 3,000. So it's still a big achievement that. Two videos in 12 months under 3,000. So they've been averaging four, five, six, seven thousand, 7,000, up to 17,000. But a bit gutted. But on the plus point, all the big YouTube channels, they've not got the views this week as well. So it must be nobody's watching YouTube. Um, I'll just show you this step. Did you know that, eh? Well, We've got 2,700 views, but I've not mentioned no names. Yeah, I don't know that. Oh yeah, she she yeah, sits on she, she's on it, yeah. I think can I be. Anyway, so keep watching. Hopefully this will be a good one. Uh we'll pick a better title. Didn't mean that. Oh no. Well step. Anyway, but look, um uh, that piece of wood watch when I walk on it, see what happens, watch. See it? It's sliding on the wood. So all the carpet pulls up. So that wasn't the best idea in the world, but it was, right? Because I'll just point a few things out. As you can see, there's holes there in the that soft end. We originally put the caravan steady feet on. Is that what they call them? Steadies. Steadies. Why is this not on? We've all just arrived. The caravan steadies on. Give me sweetie pie. And uh it, it brought the step out because it's had the steadies on to the uh, Deb's got vertical, haven't you? Yeah. So when she was walking out, I kept seeing the, the gap and falling. Yeah, not down it, falling off. The no, side. so when she's coming out, she could see that gap it and, throws me balance. and it throws a balance. And the other time, she's gone like that. I drove, I drove it as that. Like so the feet was out, and be quite honest, the feet as well. Because if you look, we're on storm. Right, as far as the other step is concerned, I get it. Right, we, we tried using this one as well. Oh, sp spiders in it. No, they'll not be. So, but look, just show you on the thing, you can't keep it still, can you? So, we was putting that on the carpet. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say is, watch. There's a big bubble in it though, isn't there? Watch. What? It slides. I did, but that's not good for the knee. But yeah, but what I'm trying to say is, I'm just going off some of the comments. Right, so this is a a step with big feet. Isn't it? So we've tried that one. That yeah, because I've just walked off step. So just let me put this out there, one sec. Right, so the plan is now. Well, the plan is to get a new carpet, really, but uh, I'm not getting it out now. I've got a plan. You're out of breath. You've only walked down a bloody I'm step. I'm fat. I'm unfit, I mean. Not fat. I'm, I'm unfit. Uh, so I've got a plan, uh, and I'll show you that tomorrow. There's no point in me telling you what I'm going to do. You've got to watch the video. Where are you going now? Putting that back, because I know you'll leave it there all weekend. What? Well, we, didn't, we never showed you that last week, did we? Uh... Mark and Sarita, 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 cow bag. So, and they still love them cows, she moved them. Oh, they're there. Right, so I've got a plan. If anybody's got an idea, because look, the carpet moves, it's on mats, but the mats on storm. You said this over and over, I know. Mr. Repeat. Right, uh, I'm going to chip in our sweetie pie. Chipper? It's six o'clock. I thought you said you were having a Chinese. I'm having a Chinese. You're having, are you having an Indian? Are you going Dawson's? I'll have a starter. All right, because I think I went in down to go Dawson's. Um, right, so yeah. Hopefully, Bye. I've gone on too long. 
Jesus Christ. I'll show you what I'll do with that step tomorrow. I'm going out for a day. See you in a bit. Bye. Huh? Not finished. I'll try it again. See you in a bit. Bye. Morning. Saturday morning. She, she's up. Morning, sweetie pie. It's only quarter now. She's got up. Uh, I'm going to go to the laundrette. Uh, show you how beautiful it is how, how beautiful it is outside this morning. Then we're getting ready and we're going out, don't we? Been up since seven o'clock. Some of the... early, Oh yeah. Uh yeah. Uh some dogs barking at seven o'clock this morning. Don't know if they're coming from that boat yard or or here, I don't know. And somebody with a bloody chainsaw. You not hear that? Chainsaw cutting wood it sounds like, right, so I'll go and get washed in and then we'll see you in a bit. See you next week, bye. Bye. A bit windy. Oh, look at Donkey Creek. Middle of September. Absolutely full. Isn't it? So, get into Donkey Creek. And we go. Just put me washing in. Jane's in the office. Just put me washing in. Go back now. Uh, then I'll go up to Kendall. Uh, see you in a bit. Well, I'll just show you the seasonal side actually. Because that is obviously always full. <laughs> Gorgeous day. <clears throat> just a little bit of a tip. You know what happened yesterday? There was a couple trying to get in in the caravan. Who's that? Oh, look at that. Andrew! Morning, Andrew! Morning. Hello. Yeah, not so bad. Just a little bit of a tip. Listen to this. Are you saying hello while you're here? A little bit of a tip, right? I've just put my washing in. Morning, is, everybody. Morning, this is Andrew and Jules. Is she still in bed? Is she up? No, she's in only. She's up. Got here yesterday, right? Yeah. Uh, couple try. Oh, you know that you came round, didn't you? Yeah. And I've just given a bit of a tip. Never give your code to let anybody in. Correct. Because they booked the wrong week and we was going to let them in and they'd have been on that page from when the people would have come. Yep. They want to go on. So I'm just saying, Luke, isn't it? Morning. Morning. Absolutely rammed Donkey Creek, isn't it? Yeah. In the middle yeah. of September. Yeah. So get yourself down here and make sure you book by a phone call. Yeah. Right, See we're going. In See you in a bit. <laughs> right, I want to just have some breakfast. And uh, don't show this breakfast for me, sweet pie. What are you having? What am I having? I'm having salt and pepper chicken. Why, why am I pathetic? That in the morning. It's half, it's half nine. I got this last night. Yeah, do you know, you, they go on about... Eh? Not listening to you. Not listening to me. But they go on about breakfast, dinner and tea. Uh, who comes up with the idea that breakfast has to be baked in sausage and egg and beans? You can have breakfast for tea. Can you? Just give more of the I'll, I'll have a lot of it. Just a little bit of it. I bought it last night. Look at that. It's better when it's cold. Keep rolling that. When you go into shop, got to buy jeans and it's there. Yeah, never refer to jeans. All right. Cheap Keep rolling. Eat that for breakfast. Oh, God, that's all that. Right, I'm going to crack on. I'll eat this. But I'll not eat it all. And then we're going out and we'll show you what we get up to today, eh? Looking forward to today, actually. See you in a bit. I don't think I've ever showed you the seasonal pitches. Toilets, Luke, we have ensuite individual blocks in here. Shower, sink, everything else, toilet. This is the biggest one. Your own privacy when you're having a shower. Light up, oh look at that, he's handsome isn't he? Light up mirrors for you. So I've never showed you that. There you have it. Seasonal pitch toilet box. See you in a bit. Get all the clothes out of the dryer now. Put them in, in the out of the washer. Deb yeah, says I don't do nothing. But I do the little bit, isn't that? It's cheaper, it's four pounds to wash all your clothes in this massive washer. Whoops. A two point dryer. There you have it. 
So, put this in for 20 minutes now. Come back again, and then it'll all dry. See you in a minute. Right, I'm going to try to velcro all this to that wood and uh, hopefully so all I need to do is I can't do it so I'm going to I'm going to knock camera over actually all right, let me move camera, hold me a minute. Not very good, am I? But I'm gonna get this filter off one side, hopefully put it in position here on the wood. Stick it down. Oh! oh! Dead. <laughs> I'm filming too, by the way. <laughs> it's not there. All right, so I've got <laughs> Well, it's fine then if you put it in. So I'm going to put. It's better than being miserable. Yeah, true, yeah. I'm going to put three of these down. Because well, I've only got three. And then we'll see if the step. I can't see that working. Well, I, well, I can't. But if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. What, and then can we move that one? And then we'll. Uh... Right. So now. I'll take the back off. Take the back off and then I'll stick it all down at the same time. Right. Now hopefully. See? Hopefully. That won't move, so put step back on. Peace bye, give it a go. Let's see what happens. It's, a bubble. it's not moved though. It's not moved. So that, that bubble you put. So I'll right, sort that bubble out. Come on, go back up it again. Right, come back down again. Oh my god, getting set. Move! Come on, just just do Did you see that? It moved. Yeah, well it's not it's not sliding. Is it? Well, okay. that's better, I think. Right. If anyone can come up with an idea, apart from taking that wood out, I'll move that. Don't worry about that. You've got half a move to pull. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm doing nothing else. Have I? Right. Let's, let's go. Go on. Sweetie pie. It's not moved. And it's solid on wood. So that velcro is stopping the carpet from slipping. I think that's 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 all right that then. Uh one more try, go on. Oh, one more try. See? No, that's perfect. Uh see in a bit. Throw them away the crap now. Well, They're only one sided. It's always only one sided. Alright, see in a bit. Bye. I just landed at this farm up in near Kendall. I can't remember what it's called, so Deb will put a link in. Hopefully. And. Oh. Hello. Hello, then. Come on. Hello, then. Come on, then. Don't bite. Bite. They don't bite. And there's a caravan park there as well. Right, we're going to have a look at shop. Oh, look at that caravan park. It's in a bit. There's your own little caravan park in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six pitches in a tent. Trailer tent. Trailer tent. Yeah. <coughs> right, somehow we've got to get over there to them cows, haven't we, Deb? Yeah. Right, let's go and have some food. See, you come for a walk down there. See him walking. Right, uh, let's go and have a look. It's in a bit. Yeah. So everything is up the arrow. Have you found any cider? No. No. Um, 
Oh, little gins there, aren't they, Sal? Oh. I can make a shot this, isn't it? Mm. Right, we're going to walk upstairs, eh? Where's Dead gone? Mm. Right, let's go and walk upstairs and get some to eat. Damn some beer. Yeah, we thought it was, yeah. Oh, that? Oh, yeah, it's gin. Right, let's go and have some to eat. It's like walking to a caravan. with all cows, want some beer. Excuse me? It's like walking up to a caravan. We've got all cows, what's here? Oh, well, let's go and have a look. That is the milking parlour we've come but to see, but cows have already been milked, obviously. Half past three. What? Half past three, milking. It says milking cows daily at 3.30. Yeah, so we'll go around Kendall. Oh, We're just having some to eat. Tony's mourning about prices <laughs> of everything. We'll have some to eat, go for a walk, and then... What oh, Darren wants to be back for four though. No. Don't you? You want to be back for four for rugby? Look at face on it. Are you going no? Face says otherwise. See? Yeah? Get back when we get back. See you out in a bit. Thanks. Right, we didn't do much filming in there, didn't we? Nice in there though, wasn't it? Yeah. But we left it a bit late, breakfast stopped serving. So <laughs> we've got to come back. Uh, half past three, that's when the milk has been cows, isn't it, Deb? Yeah. So we'll come back and we'll probably have a, a bite <laughs> or something to eat then. We didn't do much filming because it was packed. And, uh, hey, look at caravan park there. That's alright, isn't it? <laughs> so, there is some cows over there, so we've got to go and see. Darren's dying on us. Are you what? okay? Are you okay? I'm fine, don't worry about me. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about you. Oh. Right, we'll go and see if we see these cows and we'll get back when the milk eat cows. See you in a bit. Huh? They're a bit gutted, we can't get to the cows. They're over there, they've got a fence behind them. Dev's trying to ride this one, get to them. Well, let's see if I can zoom in a little bit. Yeah, like I said, we'll come back, see if we can see the cows. We'll see you in a bit. Oh, look where we ended up. We ended up in McDonald's at Midorum. Mm -hmm. Got a McDonald's for dinner. See you in a bit. Where Deb's at? Because it says 3.30. Apparently this is where they do all the milking and the curries. So Deb's got to watch them get milked. I am not moving. Very clean. She said if anybody comes, if anybody comes, you're not moving. See you in a bit. <laughs> She's making sure we normally get in this place. You're out of order, you know. No, no kids. No kids, just a right. See in a bit. Damn, you can't keep doing that. Just got the kids, we can stand on step for the ball. Can't keep doing that. Well, the bastard done that. Look. Can't see, I know. No, can't You're see. You're not tall enough. Right, we'll do you in a second then, Rod. Come on, Moose. I will let like kids. Eh? I will let kids. Not bad. Yeah, but you just told one move. No, I didn't. Yeah. <laughs> it was an old lady, that, not kids. I bought you a latte and a scone. They treat everybody 20 odd quid, and yours is freezing there. Uh, Alright, I'll show you when they come out. See you in a bit. That white ones are bigger than it. Hello. Oh, that noise is good. Well, they know, isn't it? Okay, like a big kid on Christmas Day. You in? Well, they know what they're doing.
I believe I'm getting used to guys. Oh, you right. are? Yeah. These white ones are bullying it then. It's bullying them all, saying I'm in first. It is though, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Should be one in a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna just go straight there. Come on, flat the car, wait, isn't it? I guess we'll know when this game's over. Come on, bully that. Bully, bully, bully. Come on. Black and white ones are beasts, look at it. Yeah. Well, you didn't get in first after all, did it? Did it go? Really? <laughs> We're going to get trapped here. <laughs> hey, brother. They want to go, don't they? Yeah. Oh, it's a shame. Oh. Come on, you're your trap. Right, that's it. Can go like this. Get a bit. Right, a different window. Have a light. And that's only minutes, guys. Right, oh, the end of that sweet pie. Yeah. You should have seen her face. It was like a big kid at Christmas. Oh, see, Tony. Hang on. Hello. Uh, yeah, it was battering it, wasn't it? Tony just Alright, see you in a bit. Enjoy the day, eh, Darren? Yep. Things are alright, wasn't it? Yeah. Didn't have, not, didn't have nothing to eat. We just had scone and lattes and all that. This place here, it's worth a visit. I can't say what it's called. It's called. 
size of uh, uh, what? That's it. See you a bit, Darren. See you a bit. Me and Darren enjoyed that one day, didn't you two? Yeah, we yep. go. Yep. Well, tell us uh, we for a walk. Did you yeah, enjoy that, Ed? She actually it. moved out of the way for some kids, didn't it's you? It's not all tight. No. No. You looked at your face, though, and you thought, look at that little old woman there. I'm joking, I'm joking. Smash your face, eh? Yeah, seen a bit. <laughs> little Tracy's back's gone. Look at her. Look at how he's walking. He's pulled a muscle. And oh my God, don't I know about it. Never met anybody like Donna. See you in a bit. And here she comes. Did you manage to have a little poo poo? <laughs> it's not funny, Deb. Back's gone. There's nothing better to do, you. <laughs> it's probably through carrying that ever load. That's why it's gone. Watch him. Watch him when he comes in. He'll drive a tarset. What, from a pulled muscle? How did you do it? Just bend it down? Oh, ah! <laughs> it's not funny, Dad. It's just a muscle. Hey, don't tell having this here. That I've just said it's probably for you carrying that heavy load. Well, I've just got rid of that heavy load. <laughs> Nasty. See you in a bit. Bye. Turn it off. <laughs> oh, no brief. <laughs> That's it for this week's vlog. Isn't it? Deb's got a little notepad ready there. I'm a little bit injured. Oh. But I'm, but I'm going to go to work. I wish uh, you'd get injured in your jaw. Uh, let me just, I'll set this up here and I'll sit down with you. Uh, just bear with me a second. Yep, well, yeah. And camera's facing the wrong way. Let's have a look. There you go, that'll do. Alright, let me sit down. You better straighten up, pal. Uh, have you ever seen anything like it because of a full muscle? We've been out. We've been, we had a good weekend, haven't we? We've been out to... You, there's nothing wrong with your neck. Move your head. You like that? Uh, a little bit on the cows. Sorry it took so long on the cows. It's not stopping you shouting, is it? It's not affecting me, Bob. I wish it would. I think I fixed a step. What do you mean? You're sorry it took so long on the cows? Well, there was about 10 minutes of them cows, wasn't there? No. Uh, it was nice, though, actually. Um, wasn't it? We didn't have nothing to eat. Not because it was expensive, it's because it we went through breakfast, but it was too late. By the time we go to bed, on oh, Deb, and then uh, there was... Now I was up at 8 this morning. Yeah, she was up at 8 o'clock, yeah. So, we've got some shout-outs. Eh? Yeah, are you ready? What are we going to do straight away? Well, unless you want to say something. You usually like sound of your own voice for a good five minutes and then... No, I'm poorly. You're not poorly. I'm poorly. It's going to work today and I cannot... I might not go, I might book a week off work. No, you're not. I cannot wait for him to go off today. Really? Oh, really? I've been speaking up this weekend. I'm not on about this weekend, I'm on about now with you. <laughs> no, I can't. Okay. Ah, thanks. See, you're a big queen. My uh, knee, hang on. That was very painful, that my knee then. But... See how you didn't notice? I just saw you. <laughs> Come on. Come on, what? Well, I'm dying here, Deb. I'm in an awkward position. Well, move. Can't. Put yourself I'll in a position. Up. I've just been doing this morning and I heard it go crack or whatever it did. And, uh, in pain. And she decided to film it when I go to the toilet. Len Bryan wants a shout out to his lovely wife Sue. He wants to say happy birthday and anniversary for the 23rd of September. 45 years married. Congratulations. Could have done that next week, 23rd. Come on. Five little. Oh, so it's 17th today, 18th. Oh no, it would have gone, yeah, yeah so, so happy birthday. Butt out, pal. And happy anniversary. Yeah. Now, Wendy, we forgot, it's Tony's fault, to give a shout out to your husband, Steve. What were we giving him a shout out for? You didn't write it. Was it his birthday? What was it? Right, Wendy. Give me 
a second and I'll tell you why you wanted a shout out. Because Tony's in Wendy, that. Wendy, Tony's in Wendy that. Wendy wants a shout out to her husband Steve. Sorry, we missed you last week. Tony's in that much pain. Doesn't say. Yeah, it was his birthday on the 9th. So, sorry we missed you last week, Steve. But happy birthday for the 9th. The 9th of February. Yeah. Sorry, Steve. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm in agony, you see. So. Happy birthday to Kelly with lots of love from your husband Jason and your girls Ollie and Sammy Jo. So, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Jason. Paul. And Kelly. Kelly, sorry. Yeah. Happy... Sorry, sorry. Happy... Paul. Paul wants to give an happy birthday shout out to his wife who's 60 today. Vita. He loves your loads and he loves his... Well, your retirement travels a lot. So, happy birthday. Angela wants to give a shout out to her husband Paul and say that you're a rock and she couldn't have got through the last few weeks without you. And she says, happy holidays, happy two week holidays and she loves your loads. What's that? Oh, and our Connor, my little grandson, wants a shout out. So, hello, Connor. Hi, Connor, love. Connor, right, he's got his own little YouTube channel, hasn't he? Yeah. <laughs> what's, what's it called? Lapa Jump Scares or something like that. So, hi, Connor. Uh, oh, my mum wants a shout out. She wants to call me dad, actually. She wants to say he's tight. Because last, do you remember last week when we went to Fleetwood? Fleetwood and Market. We only found this out after, didn't we? My mum and dad were in in market at exactly the same time as us. We must have gone round the toffee stall as they've gone round the toffee stall. But my dad used his brains and only bought the one pound bags instead of the three pound bags. But my mum says my dad's tight. He's not. He's I'll just, give all them toffees, actually. It's just sensible. Oh, I see a burger and snatch it. But it's not burger really because you've ended up giving them all. Yeah, that's because I'm kind. So, hello, Mum. Hello, Dad. Hello, Mum and Dad. And what's that, sir? Steve, what's that, sir? Steve Isot. I met him at Chesterfield. I'll say this because he's a. Uh, I met him at Chesterfield and I, get it, I thought I need a 45 minute break. So, I put my wagon on break, gets out, and I go, hey, up! Turns around and this. Steve was there. Now, apparently, I met him before, 12 months ago. And he just says, can you give me wife Mandy a uh, shout out? He loves you, Lords, Mandy. Uh, but be quite honest, I have to talk to him. I think he loves himself more. Uh, no, I'm only joking, Steve. But he's a nice lad, um, and no doubt I'll see you plenty more times. And that's it. Oh, and the big one. You missed it out. Can't believe you missed that. And it's here. Happy eight years oh, yeah. to Tommy Addy, my dad. Nice dad. We're going today. We're going early. We're going to see he, my dad. He's a minute, Tommy. He's a minute. You are. You are. God help me. What are you trying to say about my dad? <laughs> I love you, Dad. Yeah, I know. So happy birthday, Dad. 80 today. Yeah, uh, happy birthday, Tommy. And we'll see you in a bit. Uh, and that's it, is it? Yeah, that's for the show, guys. Oh, happy birthday yesterday, Mark. Oh, Mark, Pilton, yeah. Happy birthday yesterday. We had a cracking meal with him last weekend, didn't we? Right, that's it. I'm going to go because I can't cope with the pain anymore. Oh. I'm not on about you, Deb. I'm on about my back. Right. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. If you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. We'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.